Here's what we call a kip to an iron cross. That's not a bad cross. His body position on the shoulders was pretty good. And he comes back with what we call an in-locate to a, a straight arm back up rice handstand. Followed by a straight arm front up, front swing to a handstand. Now his inverted cross is a lot stronger. And he went right to a whip it to an L. That's a very, very difficult trick. As you notice, because he bobbled a little bit out of it. Because you have a lot of speed coming out. This is Vladimir Artemov we're looking at. And the dismount he did was a layout fight, which is a little bit different. Again, you are deducted if you don't hit that, if you don't hit that dismount precisely. And that exactly. means if you step exactly. back or step forward, you, you lose a tenth just about every step. Here you see him doing the uh, front swing to a handstand, straight arm. Again, fairly pretty good control as far as the shoulder position is concerned. This is the inverted cross. The position's well, not bad at all. Now he's doing this whip it and trying to hold right the L and his legs drop. 9.20, the score for Vladimir Artemov. That's a good score for that routine. Which puts him in third place now. Make that in second place. Mike McKellen throws an unusual part here. You won't see too, too many guys doing